When you walk past a mirror and you're used to seeing yourself in a certain way, I sort of have to take a double look and think, could I look much better today? Hi, my name's Julia. This is a video about facial revitalisation acupuncture, sometimes known as facial rejuvenation acupuncture. It's a treatment which uses needles in the face, acupuncture needles, and some needles in the body, and combines this also with facial massage. Uh, it's used for beautifying purposes. Uh, often the person gets health benefits also. Today I'm going to speak a little bit about it and you're going to meet Paula who's been having the treatment with me and we're going to actually show the treatment in process. The treatment stimulates the blood flow to the face, the blood is carrying oxygen and nutrients and this effect tends to bring more radiance and more health to the face. How we look and our health are not, are not separate things. Um, so, although in the West we have certain treatments such as facial surgery and fillers and Botox where we just work on the face, this treatment actually works in a more subtle way, but it works from the internal health of the person. So what happens usually during a course of treatments is that the person's health improves and the, the facial appearance improves, the complexion improves. Um, person tends to look more radiant. Now, there's specific ways of working, for example, to reduce bags onto the eyes, um, to harmonise the colour of the face, um, to soften facial lines, and it helps actually increase collagen produ production. And collagen is the thing that we need to keep elasticity and firmness in, a, in our skin. Also, it's increasing the lymphatic drainage, and when lymph gets blocked, then things are not flowing properly. It's more likely that we have disease. When lymph is flowing, toxins can be, can be cleared away, and we tend to look also brighter, clearer in our face. So, I'm going to hand you over to Paula, who's going to speak a bit about her experience of this treatment. Paula's 57 and she's been having a course of facial acupuncture with me and afterwards we'll actually do a treatment which you can see. Immediately after the treatment I actually do feel quite an uplift in, in my sort of facial structure, the muscles seem almost happier I would say. Um, and my general appearance is much softer, my eyes are less puffy, um, my lips are slightly more plump, um, and less heaviness around the jawline, less sort of sagging around the jawline. It's quite an immediate effect, um, but it does actually improve over the next few days. It seems to get better and better. A real softening of the skin, um, um, lessening the appearance of the wrinkles seems less. Um, sort of tightening of the skin, not, not a taut feeling, but kind of an uplifting feeling. Yeah, I suffered very badly from acne as a teenager, it sort of started when I was about 13, so I was left with a lot of scars, um, and also large, I've had large pores as well, it seems the sort of thing that runs in my family, we all have sort of very large pores in our skin, and I noticed after the treatment that um, the texture of my skin is much smoother, um, pores seem smaller, um, I, I don't actually notice my pores as much actually after the treatment and I've always had, I guess it's because of the acne, there's, there's always been kind of a bumpiness to my skin and I've noticed after treatment it's much smoother. I, I would definitely recommend this treatment because it is so natural and uh, it has other benefits other than anti-aging, it, it generally has health benefits that um, I wasn't expecting. Yeah, I suffer quite badly from arthritis in my hips and knees. And um, when I, at the beginning of the treatment, Julia usually asks me if she can help me with anything specific. And I will mention certain things such as pain, 
um, some digestive problems and Julia generally treats these by putting a needle in a specific place. And I've noticed afterwards that there's been considerable healing, considerable lessening of pain, um, even as we speak. I think the last treatment was two weeks ago. I don't have any pain in my knees or my feet. Prior to the treatment, I was very, very aware of considerable pain every day, just moving around. Um, and I don't notice that anymore. You know, I, I actually feel I, I move around much more easily and I'm not constantly sort of wincing with pain. I don't, actually, I don't actually feel the needles going in, I just sort of feel a sort of pinprick on the surface. Um, it's, it's not bad at all. Um, and the massage afterwards is actually very relaxing. The sort of having the oil put on the skin and smoothing the skin, and then the dermal roll afterwards. It actually it feels very nice. What I have noticed is you know, when you walk past a mirror and you're used to seeing yourself in a certain way, I sort of have, have to take a double look and think, God, I look much better today. My skin looks fresher. And, more uplifting. Yeah, you know, I, I have to take a double take sometimes, you know, because it it there is such a difference. Um, I've had dermal fillers in my lips, and the problem with that is it, it is actually quite extreme. You sort of you have to have um, painkilling injections first of all, and then you have to have needles inside it quite deeply into your lips. And when you come out, you're sort of very puffed up, your lips are very swollen and lopsided. And, um, and people can actually really tell you've had something done, they kind of keep looking at you. <laughs> when I look back on it, when I look at pictures from sort of shortly after I've had it done, I can see that my lips look kind of stretched and unnatural, whereas I find the facial acupuncture it doesn't really alter sort of the structure of your face in any way. It, it just improves it, it softens it. And, um, the end of the treatment, I usually feel extremely relaxed um, to the point where I actually find it difficult to stand up right away. <laughs> but yes, it's very relaxing, um, very calming feeling. I'm just going to start by doing some lifting techniques. There's many ways that we use the needles in this treatment and uh, this one the needles go very superficially to the scalp and they can just help to, to give a lift to the face. Um, some of the needles are going into acupuncture points and some of them, like this one here, is working more with the, with the formation of the bone and helping to bring out the, the cheekbone again. Um, and this one down here, for example, can help to relieve tension in the jaw. And needles help to release tension but also to um, increase the circulation between the neck and the face so that can give a lifting um, onto the jaw. After we've done the face needles, we will also add body points, regular acupuncture points, which are related to the person's constitution and are used to help with whatever it is that might be going on with their health to support their life, their health. So we've taken the needles out. I'm just going to go over the skin gently, the derma roller. Can help again the circulation and the blood flow to the face and just harmonise um, where the needles have been, helping to spread the energy and the blood that we've stimulated more harmoniously through the face. 
So the last part of the treatment is the facial massage. This is going to help to moisturise the face and I'm using argan oil which is fantastic. It's very high in vitamin E and it's uh, very softening. I love this one with, with rose in. and we can use this on any skin type but it's really good stuff. Again, I feel the massage is quite important. It helps to spread the effect of the treatments around the face. It's also hopefully very pleasurable for the person. And massage is really great also for helping the condition of the skin. And we're helping to draw the facial tone, the facial muscles upwards the massage. And we can work on specific muscle groups also. For example, there's muscles that come this way around the mouth. So that's going to help those muscle fibres to elongate, to release, release tension. Complexion is really glowing and there's a natural radiance and I think that that's one of the, the best benefits of this treatment. It brings out the person's natural health and natural radiance. I'm working around the area where the neck joins the skull, releasing tension and helping again the free flow of nutrients, blood and lymph between neck and head. It's also a nice part of this treatment. She looks very relaxed. Thank you for watching this video today. I hope you found it enjoyable and interesting. And if you've got any questions or you want to book to see me, my details will come up in just a moment. Bye bye.